everybody, Max Parker here. The final day of E3 is upon us, and I just got out of the Capcom booth and saw a little bit of the Mega Man Legacy Collection, which is an amazing package for big Mega Man fans. So Mega Man Legacy Collection includes Mega Man 1 through 6 in one package for Xbox One and PS4. But Capcom really went above and beyond to make this feel like a new game. So you're able to choose on the fly Mega Man 1 through 6, and then you can also change it between if you want the old school graphics of the 4-3 ratio, or you can make it widescreen 16 by 9. They also added cool filters so you can play it like you're playing on a CRT TV, or you can change it up like you're playing on a monitor. And within that 4-3 ratio, you can also add artwork for borders, or you can just have black borders uh, for the widescreen TV. Also, the hardcore Mega Man fans will love the extra features. You'll be able to see art of, for all the different bosses and characters, characters that never made it into the game. You'll see the concept art for those. There's a music player, so you can just jam out to the different stage music, the classic stage music from the Mega Man series. Also coming to the Mega Man Legacy Collection are the challenges. So these challenges are mashups of different sections from the different Mega Man games. So you might play a section of one level and then jump into the section of another level from a different game. Uh, and this is for speedrunners, so there's going to be a clock down at the bottom that keeps track of your time, and then based on how you do, you can get bronze, silver, or, or gold trophies for how you performed in, on those challenges. It's pretty cool that it's going to make it a bit of a competitive scene for Mega Man. Uh, it's a big thing for speedrunners, too. They'll really enjoy that. And you'll also be able to practice any boss, so you'll be able to jump to a boss from any Mega Man game. You don't have to unlock it or anything, it's all unlocked from the beginning. So you'll be able to just jump in and practice against any boss from any of the game. And you'll have access to all the weapons too from that game. So you can test out what works and what doesn't and what the weakness is. So it's a, it's a pretty cool feature for Mega Man fans. So Mega Man Legacy Collection is coming this fall for consoles and it's also coming to 3DS this winter. Uh, they didn't give a whole lot of details because they want to focus on the console version first. So I wasn't told a lot about the 3DS version, if it's going to have all the features that the console version has, but uh, we'll see when news becomes available for that version. The Mega Man Legacy Collection looks like it's a, got a lot of content for big Mega Man fans. It's pretty exciting to see that. So thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe and follow me on Twitter and Periscope at GameGuyPGH for all the latest E3 news and hands-on impressions from the show. Thanks for watching.